Speaking on the scene after two members of the Marsha community were violently executed and two others shot and wounded, ACP Vernon Francois says it will not be business as usual. He also had a message for mothers and family members of people engaged in criminal activity. Simone Smith of Black Malay was the second mother to lose her life in a gang warfare that began just over two weeks ago. She and another male were killed in the early hours of Saturday morning. I suppose it's normal for parents to love their kids and want to protect their kids as much as possible. But you need to be careful that if your, your child is, is, a, is a, a rogue, if your child is part of a gang or what have you, that you should, I guess, put some distance between yourself and that child because you may very well become a victim because if the, the, the rival gangs are after your child and then you are present at the time, then I suppose that's what happens. But what does he mean by not business as usual? The officer in charge of crime and intelligence in the police force was not clear. Francois did have this warning for the public. Do not criticize the police when people get killed in the course of duty. We operate in an environment where um, as soon as the police act, you know, everybody is criticizing the police action. Even if the, the, the people who we have in recent times um, shot, they've had firearms, the clear case of them having firearms in their possession, but yet still, you know, the criticism is of the police and not the, the people who carry the firearms. Um, I think we, people need to understand that it's a serious situation and just criticizing the police just will not do it. Of the more than 20 people who have been killed this year, four lost their lives by the hands of police officers. And contrary to what the ACP says, only two of the four were said to be armed. The other two were homeless man on Chaussee Road and a Miku North resident who died in what his family termed suspicious circumstances were not. Despite that, Francois is calling on the public to assist and trust the police to fight crime. But it's an overall disregard for human life in this country. There's a total disregard. People just feel that it is okay for them to um, kill other people. And to me, um, in this society, it is more like something that we look at as, as an opportunity for some action. You know, let, let us count the numbers, let us see the amount of people that have been killed. You know, let, let us criticize the police. It's an indictment on the police, the amount of homicide. This is not a case. It is a serious situation in St. Lucia that we have, all of us have to get together to try and deal with. Francois says 15 police officers have been taken off regular duty to assist SSU officers in patrolling hotspots in the city. With word that rival gangs have teamed up against others said to be armed and dangerous, one wonders if that will be enough. Carmi Joseph, HTS News, Channel 4.